everyone. Today we're going to be making a smoothie using our Metabolism Coffee, but we've got made frozen ice cubes. And this is perfect for, for you out there who doesn't like coffee. So if you don't like coffee, this is the perfect drink because you won't taste it. So you need to freeze your ice cubes um, and in one of these big long sheets, but I've made two. So I've just done one with fruit and I'm doing one now with the milk. So I'm gonna, you've got, go much through the video on how to make it with fruit. So we're gonna take the frozen coffee. So you need to use one of those large cafetiers and that makes two cups of coffee. And two cups of coffee of the metabolism is your daily allowance. So you can make, well I've done two, put one in the fridge and have one later. So you're gonna freeze your coffee, put your ice cubes in your blending. Thingy. Then we're going to add some frozen fruit, we're going to add a banana, we are going to add some yoghurt and we might add some milk if it's too thick. So it's totally up to you how you make it but this is how I make it. Uh, let's do the banana. So, we have our frozen coffee, we have our frozen fruit, a yoghurt and a banana. So let's put it all together and you will get the benefits of that metabolism coffee in a smoothie. So you're getting so much benefits in this. So let's put the yoghurt in. Put some fruit in. And bearing in mind, if you put a lot of fruit in, it's going to go thick, so you don't need too much. Let's put another bramble in there. Put banana, and again, it's just going to thicken up, so that will do. And then, we shall blend. It literally takes minutes to make a smoothie. perfect smoothie. So grab your metabolism, freeze it and get busy. See you later. <laughs> 